How to play Doom the Roguelike There are only a few keys that you need to know to get started. The arrow keys are your movement, page up, page down, home, and end are diagonal move. F is fire. R is for reload. I is inventory. G is for getting items off the ground. Also, this angular bracket lets you go down a staircase. Finally, you can access the Doom RL help system by hitting the question mark. You're going to die, and there are no extra lives. So don't get too attached to your Doom guy. That's the kind of game this is. There are a bunch of basic traits you can take to make your Doom guy more badass. Most of these will unlock an advanced trait once you have two or more points in it. The advanced traits greatly alter gameplay. And if you have the right combination of basic and advanced traits, you may unlock a single master trait. Each of the three classes has its own set of master traits. There are four main categories of weapons you may specialize in. Pistols, which become surprisingly deadly at high levels, allowing you to precisely dispatch foes in rapid succession. Shotguns, because who needs precision? Shotguns deal less damage the further enemies are away, and counts their armor twice. However, they never miss, often cause knockback, and can hit multiple targets. Best of all, their advanced trait is compatible with rocket launchers. Rapid firing weapons, such as the chain gun and plasma rifle. These have the highest potential DPS of any firearms, and the plasma rifle actually deals plasma damage, which nothing in the game has resistance against, and it ignores half your foe's armor. Finally, we have melee weapons. While you may be able to lay your hands on such weapons as the Ripper or Azrael's Scythe, it's entirely possible to beat the game, killing every last demon along the way with nothing but your bare hands. The advanced and master level traits from melee are just that good. Now there's nothing worse than leveling your Doom Guy into a master of shotguns only never to actually find any of those really good shotguns. So it's a good thing that you can modify your weapons and armor as you go. You can use mod packs to directly improve your weapons and armor. However, certain combinations of mod packs can go much further, significantly altering the nature of an item. These are called assemblies. For example, a simple combat knife can be converted into a deadly chainsword and a green armor can be converted into a tactical vest, which provides no defense but a significant boost to movement speed and dodging. There are currently 40 different assemblies. You can discover them through experimentation or by raiding Hell's Armory and finding schematics. Either way, once you learn an assembly, the knowledge is yours forever and are put on a list that can be pulled up at any time during subsequent playthroughs by hitting the capital A. Assemblies ensure that even if you don't always find what you want, you always have the ability to make what you need. Like all roguelikes, there's plenty to discover in Doom RL, and most of those discoveries will try to kill you.